Hey guys, it's Tim, and this is Pro Wrestling Unlimited. So the Hollywood Reporter put out a story the other day stating that Monday Night Raw may stay on the USA Network, but the USA Network does not want to keep SmackDown Live. They would then let the WWE shop SmackDown Live around to another network, and most people were thinking that maybe SmackDown can go to Fox and Fox Sports 1. Now with keeping Monday Night Raw, the USA Network and NBC Universal is willing to pay three times what they're paying for WWE television right now, and WWE could make anywhere from $250 to $360 million just, think about this, just on Monday Night Raw alone, and then however much more they can make on SmackDown, which is possibly $150 million. Now, as of right now, according to Variety, now, according to a new article from Variety, there are three suitors possible for the SmackDown Live show. Of course, we know Fox. Fox can put it either on FS1 or FX, but also Facebook, who just teamed up with the Mixed Match Challenge, and Amazon is also interested in getting SmackDown Live. Now, Fox, I don't see an issue with that. I think do it, go for it, that's a good one. Now, the issues I see with Facebook and Amazon, Facebook, it's that Facebook watch and sometimes it's not that great and then you have the chat on the screen and you can't watch that on your television you can only watch the Facebook watch stuff either on your mobile device or your computer and a lot of people want to watch Smackdown on their TV and also that would take away from the DVR functionality and as far as being able to rewind and fast forward while you're watching live as far as Amazon goes you would have to be paying for Amazon Prime Video which is ten dollars a month and who's going to want to pay $10 a month, especially, especially if you're already paying $9.99 for the WWE Network. So I think those two may not be that good of a choice for the WWE. And also with those being internet streaming services, it would be harder for those to pick up new fans for SmackDown Live. Unlike putting it on FS1, someone's just flipping through their cable and they see SmackDown pop up on FS1 or FX. Boom, there you go. They might say, hey, let's leave it here and see what we got. So as of right now, that is the latest update on the WWE television situation. Because of all these big numbers being floated out there, the WWE stock is at a high, hitting over $51 yesterday at closing. And one final note, just because this came out saying USA wants to keep Raw, nothing is a done deal, and they could still shop Raw out to another network as well and keep Raw and SmackDown together. But that's going to do it for this episode of Pro Wrestling Unlimited. Remember to comment below, like and share this video, like us on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter, subscribe here on YouTube, and follow pwunlimited.net for the latest in pro wrestling news.